guys welcome back to my channel let's dive straight to today's business so today we are going to talk about the step-by-step -step skin routine so the first product you should use is the hydrating cleanser you should think of your cleansing routine as the first step to adding nourishing ingredient to your skin while preparing your skin to absorb moisture you know your type of cleanser should depend on the sensitivity to products in your skin's moisture level so someone might ask should i double cleanse my skin that's totally up to you because double cleansing can ensure that impurities are removed from the skin leaving room for your product to work so if you are looking for the best hydrating cleanser for your dry skin it usually has an oil-based texture or a cream that helps the skin to stay soft and hydrated by removing dirt oil and other impurities now let's move on to step two step two is the hydrating toner toners are the most important product in your routine and can be applied with a cotton pad or with your hands in an upward motion so what does it do the hydrating toner actually preps the skin for all the good ingredients in the rest of your skincare routine you should consider it as a finishing touch to your face wash so if you should choose a hydrating toner for a dry skin you should choose a toner that help seal in moisture all day and night and make sure the one you pick is alcohol free so step three is the hydrating serum serums are also the most important part of your skincare routine that should always follow your hydrating tone when considering the best serum for dry skin you have to choose the hydrating serum that provides moisture and protects the skin from environmental pollution hyaluronic acid is great for your skin because it helps lock in that moisture but you can actually look for other ingredients like squalene ceramides vitamin c and plants and oil extract squalene is a naturally occurring lipid found in the skin to retain hydration ceramides are fats that help the skin to form barrier to retain moisture you know vitamin c is an antioxidant right because it helps protect the skin from environmental pollutions and it promotes collagen production and also can thicken the dense layer of your skin so step four is the moisturizer moisturizer is also important for all dry skins and you have to use lighter moisturizer in the daytime and heavier creams in the night and so the best moisturizing cream for dry skin must contain fortifying ingredients that can penetrate the skin's barrier this will actually help the skin to feel soft and smooth the moisturizer must also contain b vitamins like niacinamide that can clear spoils whether you have acne or wrinkles it will help balance your skin's texture now step five is the facial oil you know applying face oils after you've applied your serum and your moisturizer can help add hydration so your face oil must have antioxidant ingredients like vitamin e or vitamin c the next step which is step six is the sunscreen sunscreen is also the most important step in any skincare routine you have to wear it on your skin daily after you've applied your moisturizer and your face oil it is also very very important to wear sunscreen when you have a dry skin because harsh uv rays from the sun can cause damage and make your skin unbalanced so you have to choose a lightweight sunscreen that won't clog your pores or cause any breakout and unfortunately this can happen even if you have a dry skin this means you should go for a chemical or mineral sunscreen of at least spf 50 that is the sun protection factor we are almost done with our step-by-step -step skincare routine so the next step is the eye cream if you have a dry skin it is very essential not to forget your eye cream and you can even make this your last step of your skincare routine 
a great eye cream can actually prevent dryness and signs of aging fatigue and many more so you should choose a lightweight eye cream that has the same nourishing ingredients as the rest of your skincare routine so now you know your step-by-step -step skincare routine and the hydrating cleanser the hydrating toner the hydrating serum the moisturizer facial oil and the eye cream they are supposed to be used in the morning and in the night but for the sunscreen it is supposed to be used only in the morning that is when you are going out you wear your sunscreen because of the harsh uv rays from the sun so now we have come to the end of today's business and thank you for watching my video please subscribe you like and you share and you hit the notification bell if you are interested in my video see you next time